What's up everyone, this is Ali Takas Tech, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can destroy your friend's iPhone just with a simple text message. So let's get started. So what you're going to want to do first is go ahead and click the link down below in the description and then from here tap on the first link. Now once you've done that, go ahead and type in your victim's name. Now in this case, I'm the victim, so the joke's on me, but what you want to do is send that text message and then from here you want to go back to the website and then go ahead and tap on the second link. Now from here what's going to happen is it's going to bring you to iMessage and it's going to take forever to load. It took me about five minutes. Now this is going to be like a three-step process, so I'm going to walk you through it. But in the meantime, I just want to thank you guys so much. We hit 11,000 subscribers about a few days ago. I believe we hit it on May 8th or May 7th. I don't remember. But if you don't know, May 7th is actually the first day I started YouTube back in 2016. So it was my second year anniversary. So that's pretty cool. But anyways, back to the point. You're going to see a screen like this pop up once your iMessage finally loads and then you're going to want to type in your victim's name again. So in this case, I'm going to type in all I talk is tech because that is the number I'm going to be sending it to, but you can't really do that until the keyboard pops up. So you're going to be at this blank screen for a little bit and then boom, you're going to see it's going to pop up. So type in the name of your victim and it's going to freeze. You're going to select their name. It's going to be grayed out for a bit. Just don't do anything, but eventually you're just going to want to spam the blue button that says send. And then eventually you are going to see that the message has sent to your victim's phone. Now they're going to tap on it and it's going to destroy their iMessage. So they're not going to be able to view any new messages. And if they receive text, it's going to be very glitchy for them. The operating system will be so laggy. Now other YouTubers did cover a way to fix this by using 3D touch, but I'm going to be showing you a better way. If you don't have 3D touch, this will work for any device. So what you're going to want to do is go ahead and go to settings and then scroll down until you see messages and you're going to want to set it to 30 days. So this will basically make it every 30 days the messages will delete. Now this is a bug that I found a while back. Once you've done that, click on date and time and you want to turn off your automatic time zone. Now from here, scroll all the way down as far as you can. You're going to want to set it like three months in advance because I know setting it 30 days for some reason didn't work for me. So scroll beyond what is actually needed. Now from here, you can actually open up iMessage and it will load just fine. So that's about it for today. Hope you guys did enjoy. Thank you so much for watching and as always, peace.